I'm Michelle Coxon, a certified lymphedema specialist, and I want to tell you about lymphedema. Lymphedema is a swelling of the limbs that occurs when there's an insufficiency of the lymph vessels and the lymph node removal, so that the fluid, which is 75 to 80 percent of your body, much of it lymph fluid, is circulating through the system all the time. And if there's an insufficiency or damage or a blockage anywhere in the body, the result can be a swelling of the limb. Uh, with breast cancer, you can also have swelling in the chest, in the neck, in your back, uh, in your hand. And so uh, I want to educate you a little bit about what this is and why it occurs. Your lymph system is basically your immune system. And it's the, the fluid that circulates through the system all the time. It has its own path. It has its own rhythm. And it has components that are intended to remove toxins, uh, to neutralize pathogens that come in through the outside, to fight infection, uh, otherwise keeping us healthy. And without an immune system, we would die. So it's a very important system. And in lymphedema, that system has been compromised, generally because lymph nodes have been removed in the axilla or the armpit, which is you know, the typical surgery for breast cancer. It can be mastectomy, lumpectomy, any kind of invasive uh, surgery to the chest wall can result in lymphedema. Uh, also, radiation, which often follows surgery, uh, definitely damages the tiny, very delicate lymph vessels. But the manual lymph drainage is the primary therapy for lymphedema. And if you don't have a trained therapist at hand, then we need to know how to take care of ourselves. And even if you have a therapist you can go to for treatment, it's still very empowering to know how to take care of ourselves. So manual lymph drainage being the first, and it is a form of very light, rhythmic, slow massage uh, because the, the fluid is right under the skin. The superficial lymphatics are right under the skin in the dermal layer. And so it's a very light, rhythmic stretching and releasing of skin. And what we're doing is mimicking what the lymph system does on its own. But because it can't in that area, and it's overwhelmed with the swelling of fluid that's accumulated in the tissues, then we have to manually move it and we're mimicking its rhythm, its pace, and its pressure, and the direction that it needs to go. So, manual lymph drainage being the first, and you will learn that in this video. Um, the next is compression. That's the next thing that you need to look at. Compression meaning a garment. It's a sleeve that you would wear during the daytime there are also nighttime garments, but for the sake of this information, it's a daytime garment. Uh, you wear it when you exercise, but you do not wear it at night. And the compression is such, because it's a very particular kind of, of knit and a very particular kind of stretch, and it mimics the pressure that the body automatically has to keep the lymph moving. So clearly when the, that limb can't function normally, then we put the, the garment on. You know, as you move your arm and as you breathe, it mimics the pumping of the lymph vessels to move the fluid up into the collection sites. Why is it important to be treated? Well, because if you don't, you are prone to infection. You're prone to an overload in your immune system you're prone to the immune system not functioning normally, which affects your entire life. 
Rita Dave is my client, and we've known each other for quite a while now, and she's going to teach the exercise phase of this protocol and talk about the skin care aspects of the protocol. And so these four or five things that you can do are going to manage an otherwise psychologically burdened uh, condition. And you want to think of this as your own love for yourself, your own care for yourself, that there are tools that you can use to manage this and it doesn't have to become a horrible thing in your life. So that's what we're going to try to show you. And um, I'm excited that you want to learn it. And I know that it's going to be very positive. It's going to give you enormous um, empowerment. It's going, to, it's going to improve your self-image. It's going to improve your immune system. It's generally going to keep you healthier in your life as much as is possible with this condition. So thank you very much. And we will go on to the next uh, treatments. Yes.